are three little tricks. Being over 50 with your makeup that can change entirely the way that you look. We change as we get older, so your makeup routine needs to change and go along with you too. So one of the most important things is, is contour. I typically like to use a bronzer now instead of a gray color of contour. And I'm gonna go ahead and show you with our Endless Summer Cream Bronzer and watch where I'm gonna show it. So normally we go, mm, suck it in and go here. You can still feel in there, but I want you to go just above, just above that little hollow, just like that. And we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna just place and tap that in. It's not gonna be a long line, just like that. And look, hello cheekbone. My second piece of beauty advice is blush. It's one of the most underrated products in your makeup bag, but one of the most important. Let's talk about blush and let's talk about placement because it's not the same placement that we used to do when we're in our 20s and 30s because our apples are now down here. So what we wanna do is give the look that our apples are still right in the basket. So we're gonna do that up above. Now, really cool thing, put your finger where your iris is, no color should go towards the nose. All color needs to go after where the iris is and up. My other piece of advice, and I think one of the most important, is concealer placement because we used to put our concealer all over, right? We don't want to do that anymore, so we want to put it naturally in this area, and I'm using that doll skin concealer right here where we naturally get dark, and then I want you to take right where that eye is just above the blush, and just do a nice sweep up just like that. And then you can go ahead and take your brush and you're gonna go ahead and just blend it out or use your finger and pat it out. But I want you to see how much more lifted this side is versus this side. Contour, which we're using a bronzer, blush is higher, concealer here. Look how lifted this side is and contour is versus this. So there are three of my favorite things that I do being over 50.